The first of my choices for the Sinead and Rick's must reads for autumn is this. It's Emily Pine's Notes to Self. Now, I appreciate that initially the pitch of a series of non-fiction essays being written by an associate professor of drama at UCD in Dublin might not necessarily light your fire. Bear with me. This book deals with some of the most complex subjects uh, about being a woman. It deals with uh, the nature of assault. It deals with relationships. It deals with the female body. It deals in some part as well about the human relationship with alcohol too. And it's one of the most honest and vivid sets of essays that I've read in a really long time. The back of it, uh, Anne Enright says, do not read this book in public, it will make you cry. She's right, it did. In particular, there's one essay in the center that is about the nature of uh, trying to become pregnant and about trying to have a family. I don't cry very often when I read books. In other way, people say, I bawled through reading this book, I was in tears. I, I wonder, do people mean that or do they use it as a metaphor? For me, I was actually in tears and I was actually bawling through one of the essays in this. The rest of them are some of the most honest things I've read anybody say uh, at any point uh, over the course of the last few years in the course of an Irish book. It is a thing of absolute beauty and I hope that you love it as much as I did.